Those of you who know me and who've watched this channel for a while know that I've had varying opinions on suit supply over the years, but you'll recall that one of those opinions was that I really believe that they offer a great value to quality ratio. And today I've partnered with Suit Supply to show you 10 of my favorite pieces in the collection right now, take you through the entire custom made process from start to finish, and then put together six different outfits. All that right after this. I'm Brian Sakawa. This is He Spoke Style, advice and inspiration to help you dress better, develop your personal style, and be more confident. All right, let's jump right in and take a look at the 10 items I picked up. Up first, we have this off-white knit polo. It's a mix of cotton and silk, 70% cotton, 30% silk, light and breathable. Uh, the placket is buttonless, so it has a very chic look. Polo, of course, is a wardrobe essential, and this is a really unique and elegant take on that. Here we have a classic crew neck sweater in a cream color. Uh, it's merino wool, very soft, super comfortable, great foundational piece. Up next, we've got the first of a few tailored items, starting off with this beautiful brown houndstooth sport coat. This is the Havana model, linen, wool, silk, and cotton blend. Uh, it's got a great feel in the hand. It's a two button, notch lapel, patch pockets. We've got working sleeve buttons, completely unlined. As you can see, very, very comfortable. Great casual sport coat that I think every guy should have. Next is this really cool black field jacket. It's made with 100% linen, has a lot of heft to it, so the jacket really keeps a very nice structure despite the fact that it is unstructured. It's got four flapped patch pockets, snap closures uh, on the front, and actually inside uh, it has a drawstring feature, so you can cinch it up, uh, give it a little more shape, and sort of kind of tailor it to your own body or your own style. So one of the biggest gripes I've had with Suit Supply clothing in the past is their pants. Maybe about five or six years ago, I bought a couple pairs and they just didn't fit me well. Even with alterations, there, there was something that just wasn't right. What's funny is that when I went to the Soho showroom to get fitted for my suit, which we'll get to in just a bit, they remembered how much I did not like the fit of the pants in the past. And they said that since then, they actually made some updates, they fit differently now, and that I should give them a try again. So I did that with this pair of black linen trousers. So before talking about the fit, let's go over a few of the details here. This is the Braddon model. It's 100% linen from Baird McNutt. It's got two reverse pleats. We've got side adjusters. Uh, and then we have this overlapping closure uh, on the front. Now one thing is that this particular pair of pants comes with a cuff. Some ready to wear styles do, some don't. Personally, I don't like cuffs on my linen pants, so they were able to uh, take that out for me and make them plain bottom. Overall, these are super elegant, love the details, great alternative to cotton pants, and the fit, I have to say, that Suit Supply was right. They fit amazing, as you'll see when I style them later on in the video. Another pair of trousers here. These are the Ames, made with a tropical wool from VBC. Really nice mid-brown color, very versatile. They have an elastic waistband. Um, it's a button closure, but you've also got a drawstring feature here as well. Um, they have a single reverse pleat, uh, and then the bottoms are also elastic. So interestingly, these were too long for me, and they were actually able to shorten them even with the elastic cuff. Very cool mix of sporty and elegant. At first, they did seem a little bit outside my comfort zone, but when I actually put them on, I really loved how they wore. Um, extremely comfortable, and as a result, dare I say, that these just might be the ultimate travel pant to wear when you're flying. The next item I kind of joked about and called it the, the dad vest, but this is like the coolest dad vest you'll ever find. It's reversible. Um, this side is actually water repellent, uh, and then you could flip it around for something uh, a little softer, um, a little softer looking, a little more texture. One thing I want to point out is that both sides of this jacket 
have pockets. Um, I've seen reversible vests like this before where one side doesn't have a pocket, so that's a really cool feature of this one. Here is just a simple white button-up shirt made with an Egyptian cotton that is incredibly soft. Um, it's not actually quite that simple though because um, as you can see, um, it's not meant to be buttoned up all the way as it doesn't have a button here or up by the collar. And my favorite feature of this shirt is actually the collar. It's a tab collar and I really like the shape that it has uh, when it's buttoned. Some footwear here now, a pair of sneakers. Uh, we've got a nice taupe suede upper uh, along with a white sole. All the pieces I picked so far, I chose these because I think they're a great mix of sporty and chic. So I have always been impressed with Suit Supply's ready to wear garments, specifically their tailored pieces and even more specifically their sport coats. Over the years, I've owned several Suit Supply sport coats. I wore them all the time. They fit great. I never needed any alterations. The fabrics are fantastic and I think they represent an incredible value, especially as a ready to wear option. But the one thing I had never experienced at Suit Supply was their custom program. And I was extremely excited to try it for the first time recently at their Soho showroom, a place that I've wandered around many, many times. One of the newer features of the showroom that I got to see for the very first time is their rooftop lounge, which in addition to just having an amazing view of the city is some place that you can go, kick back, relax, have a drink, either while you're waiting for your appointment or for some alterations to be completed. Let's talk a little more specifics about Suit Supply's custom-made program and what they offer. So they can pretty much make you whatever you need for whatever you might need it for, whether that's work, a special event like a wedding, uh, and even more casual styles. Suits, jackets, trousers, shirts, waistcoats, overcoats, evening wear, a huge range. I've already talked about their fabrics being fantastic and for the custom made program, they do offer a full range of what you would call four season fabrics, as well as seasonal books from more luxury European and Italian mills. Now, one of the things I always tell people when they're going into a custom clothing experience like this is to do your research and really kind of know what you want before you actually go to your appointment. And one thing I really like about the suit supply process is that you're able to go through a portion of it online where you can see all the options you have, whether that's lapel styles, buttons, colors, tons of stuff. Um, so you're more prepared and then you can save that configuration for when you go into the store where you're measured and really able to dial things in, get that perfect fit, feel the fabrics and make that connection to a garment that you'll have and wear for many years. And as a bonus, when you do that, it's also more sustainable. I thoroughly enjoyed the process from dialing in all my details. Yes, even I like to get some suggestions when I'm doing custom to the measuring process where I was able to talk about certain fit things that I liked or things that I didn't like. All of that was taken into account. I tend to be very picky and particular when it comes to this stuff. And I have to say that when I got the suit, which is a two to three week delivery time, I felt like they nailed it. So for my suit, you know, I'm super classic. So I decided to go with a charcoal gray double-breasted suit. It's a very nice VBC Super 110s fabric. The jacket I did with a peaked lapel. Um, this is their standard width, which is about three and a half inches. You could also go with a wider version, which is about four and a half inches. It's six button. We've got dark brown buttons here. Uh, it's got a double vent. I went with jetted pockets because I wanted this to be a little bit more on the formal side. And now at Suit Supply, you have the option of full canvas, half canvas, or unconstructed. Here, I went with a full canvas, um, and that's gonna mold to the shape of my body over time and make the jacket fit even better. For the pants, just got rid of the jacket. I went with a single pleat, uh, which I always do, side adjusters, um, and a two inch cuff. If you know me, no surprise there. So that's how I styled this suit, but how does it fit? Well, we'll find out right now as we jump into our six different looks. So here we go, starting out with a full suit and styling it probably not in the way that you were expecting. Everything I picked out I feel is very chic yet casual, so 
I wanted to style the suit in a way that reflected that. So instead of a shirt and tie, we've got the cream colored crew neck sweater. Simple, elegant, and definitely that casual chic vibe that I'm trying to carry over to my accessories as well with the chunky black sunglasses, JLC Reverso on the wrist, and finished off with a pair of black suede Belgians. Even though I'm wearing the jacket unbuttoned, you can still see that it fits amazing in the shoulders, sleeve length is perfect, and it feels great across the body. Trousers also, perfect fit. They've got a higher rise, which I love, super comfortable. Length is absolutely perfect, just how I like them. Leg width and opening, also perfect. I said before that they nailed the suit, and here's the proof. Here we are with look number two, a nice, sporty, elevated, casual weekend look. We've got the reversible body warmer, which I call the dad vest, layered over the crew neck sweater and white button up, paired with some light wash jeans, white baseball cap, two-tone suede sneakers, and a little piece of nostalgia on the wrist. Anytime you're looking for ways to elevate casual attire, the absolute best way is to give some of your basic pieces a little bit of a luxury upgrade. Here, that's the sweater, vest, and shoes, all in materials that look great and feel great as well. For look number three, I'm going with the houndstooth sport coat, pairing it with the knit polo, black linen trousers, sneakers, and my traditionnel on the wrist. Again, this combo, very simple, but we've got the pattern of the jacket, the slightly unexpected knit polo, pleated trousers, suede sneakers, and a really elegant color palette coming together to take everything up a notch. Once again, just wanna say how super impressed I am with the trousers. Like the suit trousers, the fit of these, perfect as well. Length is great, leg width is perfect. I love the pleats and closure details. Higher rise feels more mature and very elegant. Here we have look number four, and can I just say that I am absolutely loving the color palette that is available in the current suit supply lineup. I'm a sucker for brown. I love dressing tonally, so this is kind of like a match made in heaven here. Back to the look, we've got the reversible vest again, layered over the crew neck and paired with the drawstring trousers and sneakers. So to be completely honest, I love these trousers. I didn't think I would, but I do. They're such a neat mix of dressy and sporty and just ridiculously comfortable. I said that these are great for travel and I just took an overseas trip and I wore them and I can confirm that they are a great option to wear on a long plane trip. For look number five, we've got a sort of rugged but chic safari suit vibe going on with the linen field jacket paired with the linen trousers. It's a great match and adding some contrast with the knit polo and sneakers once again. I mentioned earlier that you can cinch down the size of this jacket on the inside and that's what I've done here. You can see that it gives it a little more shape around my body. I know a lot of guys like the idea of a suit, but the level of formality doesn't really fit their lifestyle. Something like this though, with a more casual style jacket, is a great way to kind of keep that suit ethos, but also keep it kind of casual. Look number six now, we've got what I would consider a very classic business casual-ish combo. Houndstooth sport coat, white button up, light wash jeans, suede sneakers. Wearing a sport coat with jeans, gotta be the right fabric and we've got that here. Patch pockets, keep it casual, and the pattern helps break up the simple foundation. This is a super easy kind of go-to outfit for me. I love mixing sporty and tailored. It's no nonsense and always just a great way to elevate your look. Really wanna thank Suit Supply once again for sponsoring this video. All these pieces are great basics, incredibly versatile, and you guys know that I love the idea of having less that you can do more with. We call that a capsule wardrobe, and that playlist over there will help you get started building one, whether you're a beginner, a professional, or if you're going on vacation. 